May the road rise up to meet you is one of the best known of all Irish blessings. Here we'll read it through and then look at the meaning of the blessing, why it confuses some people and how it may have changed over the years. May the road rise up to meet you. May the wind be always at your back. May the sun shine warm upon your face. The rains fall soft upon your fields. And until we meet again, May God hold you in the palm of his hand. This version of May the Road Rise Up to Meet You is the widely used English translation, taken from the original in Irish, written long ago. No one knows just how long. Some people believe it was written by St. Patrick himself because it's similar to some of his writings with its simple religious theme and its references to nature. There's no evidence to support that, but there's nothing to disprove it either, as the author, whoever he or she was, is unknown. Many language scholars have pointed out that the famous opening line, May the road rise up to meet you, is actually a mistranslation of the original Irish, Ganoian Tarla. This references success rather than rise, so it would translate more accurately as, May you succeed on your road, which is more true to the literal meaning of the original, but also loses a little of the charm in translation. Gnarri an Tarla sounds poetic in Irish and can be used as a blessing or a toast, or just to say good luck. May you succeed on your road seems a little flat by comparison, which is why some unknown author may have decided to take a little poetic license and say may the road rise up to meet you instead, which most people would probably agree has a better ring to it, even if it's not the literal meaning. But you no sooner solve one problem than you create another. The idea of a road rising up to meet you confuses some people. What's going on here? Are we going uphill now? Surely that makes the journey harder, not easier. Not really. More likely it's a reference to ancient times when roads were rough and difficult, as in the song The Rocky Road to Dublin, or in some areas non-existent, leaving you to fight your way over mountains and bogs for miles on end. Imagine in those circumstances how it would feel to have a road constantly rising up before you to smooth your way. A blessing indeed through life. The rest of the poem is more straightforward. The wind, the sun and the rain reference the presence of God, the Holy Spirit, helping and protecting us along our journey through life. A thought made clear in the unforgettable closing lines that need no explanation. And until we meet again, May God hold you in the palm of his hand. Who wouldn't wish this for someone they love? Which is why the blessing is so popular and widely quoted, particularly at weddings by the father of the bride, offering his love and protection to the happy couple.